welcome to our analysis of a pivotal First Amendment audit in New London, Connecticut. This video examines the interaction between Daniel Kokoska, a citizen auditor, and the New London Police Department. We'll focus on the balance between citizen rights and police duties, providing a succinct legal perspective on the events that unfolded. Join us for an insightful look into this critical encounter. Hey, can I help you? What are you guys doing? Filming. For what? Just a like ten. That's it. Yeah, that's fine. You like it. Any reason you're filming? Don't want to answer any questions. What about you? You want to answer any questions? Or? Uh, they heard. They heard this. Uh, they stated that those two were over their department um, videotaping and refused to identify themselves. You can get off that car. Initial encounter when Mr. Kokoska was approached by the officers while filming in the police station parking lot. The officers were initially exercising their rights to ask questions in a public space, as established by the Supreme Court in cases like Florida v. Royer and Florida v. Bostick. At this stage, there was no Fourth Amendment violation since the interaction was consensual. Questioning and refusal to answer. Mr. Kokoska's refusal to answer questions is protected under his First Amendment rights. The officer's follow-up actions of merely observing or questioning do not constitute a seizure or violation of Fourth Amendment rights. All right, you guys are done now. So, yeah. Uh -huh. For what? You're, I'm asking you to leave the, the, the I have not done the thing. I'm asking you to leave private property now. Get out of the lot. It's not time to you have to leave business here? Yes. I'm going to the lobby now. I'm asking you, okay, you can go to the lobby, but no. you're not going over to the lobby. You can leave. I'm not doing anything. I'm not asking. You're now in a private lot and you're being asked. Where's the sign? The Where's the sign? I'm telling you now. It doesn't Go. matter. No, 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 no. I'm not asking you. Okay. Get off the property. I'm not. Then you can end up downstairs in our lockup. What you need to do. Okay. You're not here for police business. I just told you I was going in the lobby. Okay. Now. Then you can go up in the lobby. I can go up in the lobby yep. when I'm ready. No, no time limit. Okay. I'm telling Where you. Where are your signs? There are no signs. But exactly. you're, being, so you're, giving, you're being given I'm a lawful to be, order no, to what disperse. Law? What law? Disorderly conduct. For, no, I'm being, you're that's being given. Yes. Let's go. You want, here. That's disorderly right. conduct. You want to call it? Let's do it. Because I'm doing go. nothing wrong. No, no, no. Why you got to come out here and bust? bust like, yes. You came out here. I was doing nothing wrong. Okay, you're out here filming people's I'm allowed cars. to. Okay. Again. Again, what? Do you have anything better to do than come to Then thank you. I'm not going to answer any more questions. I'm going to continue doing what I was doing. You're touching me? You're touching me? Off the property. Stop touching me, please. Off the Stop property. Stop touching me, please. It doesn't, I have been asked to leave. Doesn't, listen, no, no, no. It doesn't, I don't even need police business. Okay. Even if I wasn't here for police business, it doesn't matter. You're not going this to stand out. This is public property. I can out stand out. No, no. You need to commit a crime or be suspected of a crime. Okay. Like, how are you this high and you don't you're even know that? Being asked and then you're putting leave, your hands on me? What's you're wrong with you? You're asked to leave. You can't trespass me for public property when I haven't broken a law. Okay. Come on. Are you here for police business? I just told you I was. Okay. Then what is the police business you're here for? I don't need for? to tell you. Yes, you do. No, you're I don't. You're not here for police business. I, well, I don't need to tell All right, I'm not going to answer any more questions, okay. and I'm standing right here until I'm ready to go inside. Then we're going to stand right here with go you. Go ahead. Okay, I got all I do. I got till 7 o'clock in the morning. Can you start touching me? Can you? No. I can, I'm allowed to move. Okay, and so am I. Okay, just keep touching me. Let's go. Jay, take your camera out. Let's go. Excuse me, sir. Do you really want to do this? I don't care because I haven't done Let's anything go. wrong. You're the one making yourself look like Get a clown. Get off the property. No. Order to leave the property and physical coercion. The pivotal legal issue arises when Lieutenant Burgerson orders Mr. Kokoska to leave the public property and later uses physical force. The legality of this order hinges on whether the parking lot was open to the public and if Mr. Kokoska was engaging in lawful activities. If the parking lot was publicly accessible and Mr. Kokoska was not committing a crime, the order to leave might not be lawful, making the subsequent use of force potentially unconstitutional. Use of force The use of force by Lieutenant Burgerson, as described, might be considered excessive if the order to leave was unlawful. While the Supreme Court in Graham v. Connor allows reasonable physical coercion in enforcing a lawful order, the reasonableness here is questionable given Mr. Kokoska's non-threatening conduct. You don't need to be on a If you had a reason and uh, you could really arrest me, you already no, would have done it. I don't feel like leaving me downstairs all weekend. I really don't. I don't believe that. What is your police I, business? I'm doing what I need to do. Okay. 
So if you go near a personal car, I'll go near whatever. Okay. I'm going to tell no, you, no. you're wrong. No, you know, so I, I can better, record I better, I better those cars. I can record any okay. car in this parking lot. If I, I want. catch you touching a vehicle or trying to open a door, I'm going to I want to arrest you. Now it goes to that. Did you see me do that before okay. you touched no, me and did all I that? Catch you doing? Did you did you see me? Duty. That's what you keep saying, but you're out here. Okay. You would have never came out here if you had something better to do. If you need something, come up in the lobby and deal with it. I'll be up there when I'm ready. We're all set. Trespass and public property. Mr. Kokoska's argument that he cannot be trespassed from public property unless he has committed a crime is an oversimplification. While public properties are generally accessible, restrictions can be imposed for lawful reasons. However, filming in a public parking lot typically would not constitute a valid basis for a trespass charge, especially if the area is open for public use. You're a loser. Bust you are a loser. Go find something better to do with your life. Me? I'm sorry. You're the one that came running outside like some tough guy, you clown. What a waste of time. Yo, sure. Now leave him. After you already touched me, you loser. That's all you're going to do. You can't. You're on your personal call right now. What are you going to do? And I didn't even look at him before. Now I will. Who's above you inside? I need to talk to a supervisor. Hey, babysitter, can I get you to the bathroom? Yeah, Lewis 665. Sadowski 688. Oh, can I help you? Yeah, you. Uh, can you the supervisor? I'm one of them, yeah. Um, so I was outside, walking through the parking lot, taping. Your officers, three of them came out. Supervisors started pushing me around, giving out lawful orders. Kept trying to tell me I'm trespassing and I'm disorderly when I wasn't doing Anything. Well, it's a lawful order. Yeah, if you're doing it. Oh, if you read the statute for trespass first, after giving a lawful order, regardless, yeah, you have to be committing a crime. regardless of if it's posted or not. No, yeah. but you have to be committing a crime to be trespassed on public property. All right. Well, I'm not going to argue with you on that. You're just like the rest of them. I need three complaint forms, and uh, how do I request that body cam footage? I have to go do an FOI. Through records? Hmm? Okay, so how do I get the complaints? You want a complaint form? How many? No, three. Four. Three, three complaints. But there's two of you. But you. You can put more than one officer on a form. Is that what you're no, asking? No, I want to put I do them individual. So you want four? Yeah. Okay. All right, here we go. Can I get your name badge number? Yeah, right there. Following Daniel Kokoska's complaint against Lieutenant Ferguson of the new London Police Department, an internal investigation found Lieutenant Ferguson in violation of departmental policies concerning respect, conduct, and use of force reporting. Consequently, Ferguson faced an eight-day unpaid suspension and was required to undergo retraining. The state police also investigated, but their report to the new London County State's Attorney's Office concluded that no criminal laws were violated. Meanwhile, in a separate matter, Lieutenant Ferguson's brother, Captain Todd Ferguson, was briefly placed on administrative leave due to an investigation into his use of leave time, although he eventually returned to work. The background reveals that this was not Lieutenant Ferguson's first instance of alleged excessive force, with previous allegations dating back to 2013 and 2016. Despite these issues, Ferguson had received commendations and held significant positions within the department and police union. In conclusion, while Mr. Kokoska's actions during the encounter with police might not have fully captured the legal complexities regarding public property, he effectively exercised his First Amendment rights and successfully prompted departmental action against Lieutenant Ferguson for his conduct during the incident. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe to Luminance TV for more insightful content like this. Ah!